I know a lot of same-sex couples who have had kids to go to Harvard. Mm. They have got a doctor's kids and ended up, they ended up going to Harvard. So it does not matter. It's just the parenting skills. That's all it is. If you're saying you're giving up your child, it means you're giving up all rights to Come on. how this child is raised or who raised all right, so the topic of this good first of all, hey y'all, beginning of the vlog for the week. Today is Thursday, um, February 6th. Yes, February 6th. Um, I was headed to the gym, as you can see, but I didn't bring my dang on ID badge. So instead of going to the gym, I went ahead and went to go do my background check. Um, a nice daycare is looking for part time, and she was asking me if I want to do it. So I was like, sure, but just a couple hours, like one day a week. So uh, I gotta go do it. I'm doing a background check in a second, and then I'm gonna go back home, get my ID, go back to my job, and do a little workout. I need to wash clothes today. Um, I have to edit the vlog for last week, um, today, and post it today. I just have a couple things I need to do. I need to get food out so I can cook tonight. Whew. It's gonna be a busy day. But I want to pick up the camera really quickly. Um, what else I about to say to y'all? I don't forget. Oh, the topic of discussion on the radio was there's a bill that's about to be passed that when um, for parents who give up their children for adoption, they will have the right, if they're using a faith-based place for the adoption agency, they have the right to choose whether an LGBT person or a same-sex person, a uh, same-sex marriage couple, whoever, um, they have the right to choose whether they are able to, or not to adopt their child. And the question was, do you think that is okay for an adoption agency or those who use a faith-based adoption agency? You're giving up your child. It's okay for them to choose what kind of parent they want their child to have. And personally, I'm on the fence about it. One, if you're giving up your child, you're giving up your rights. So, it shouldn't matter who decides to take your child because at this point, they're willing to be the parent that you're not willing to be. So, I kind of feel like, no, you can't choose. But then again, it's their child. They did birth them. And if you're going to a faith-based place, play faith-based place, then... If you want a child to be raised in a household like one that you believe in, then you should have that right or that choice. But at the same time, you know, you're giving up your child, so you're giving up your rights. So it's just like, it's up on a fence. It hasn't gone to the House or the Senate for the bill to be passed. But I'm more on the side of, no, you shouldn't be able to choose. You're giving up your child. But at the same time, it's just like, people have choices. I mean... You have the choice to kill somebody or not. You have the choice to pick who you want your child to be raised by or not. But at the same time, if you want them to be raised a certain way, keep them. I don't know. That's just my opinion. Don't come at me in the comments. <laughs> Too bad. Um, but, yeah, that's just what was on the radio. I didn't really... I wasn't trying to involve that on the vlog. But it just happened to be on, so I turned on the camera. But, anyway, I'm about to run in here and do this... Um, this uh background check real quick and then i'm gonna head home it's actually a flash flood on the highway so it's probably gonna take me forever to get home because it was hella traffic on 75 so i'm just gonna take my time i wish i had a gym membership because i just go right here to la fitness and work out real quick but i don't so all right so i'm back home and i think i ain't going back out honey because this rain I ain't playing with me today. Uh, it's been flash floods, tornado warnings, and all kind of stuff since I um, got up this morning. So I think I'm gonna just head in the house and we gonna just do an inside the house workout or something. Or I might come out a little later if it gets better. Ooh, I don't know. I might come out of the house a little later, but I'm just gonna go in the house, cook me some breakfast, separate clothes for laundry, and when it slows down, then I'll go out and wash clothes because right now it's just a little too much rain for me, and I already don't like being in the rain. But if I want to go work out, I am dressed to go work out, so I just do that. But 
I'm gonna be in the house. I'll just start editing the vlog while I cook and stuff. Oh my gosh, it's flooded over here. Bye, y'all. Yo. I'm getting ready to go out. Not out, out, but um, my friend Joy, her birthday was two days ago. And she didn't even tell me when her birthday was. I just happened to see her say she was 28. And I was like, so, uh, give us your birthday? She kept the whole secret. So, I convinced her to do something for her birthday. And I'm the only person she wants to do it with. Because she said her other friends, they don't, they're not her cup of tea. So, uh, she wanted to go and get some food. So, I'm going to go get some food and a couple drinks. And call it a night. Uh, I haven't been anywhere, really. We haven't hung out since, ooh, when was the last time me and her went out? I think when it first started getting cold, like right before homecoming, that was the last time we really hung out. So, I get to go see my girl, hang out for her birthday. I need to figure out what I'm doing for my birthday so she can come hang with me, but more than likely, I won't be doing anything because y'all know how I am. But I'm just getting ready. I'm listening to music. I'm just listening to music and laying my hair. I just arched my eyebrows a little bit. So I'm about to try this makeup look that I saw on uh, Instagram. And... We'll see how it goes. I might do a get ready with me. If it comes out good, then I'll do an actual video of me doing it sitting down. But um, I'll just show y'all the end product when I'm done. All right, so I ended up not doing the look that I was going for because I didn't have the color that I wanted. But um, this is my makeup look. I think I did a really good job today. Uh, hold on, let me see if I can. I think I did a really good job on my makeup uh, as far as like highlighting and contouring and I did more eyeshadow like I actually was trying so I did um the usual smoky eye when I when all else fails pull out the smoky eye but I did that I just have on my goldish looking bodysuit with my high waisted jeans and uh these booties uh the brown booties I'm not um wearing I'm not taking my purse. I'm just going to take my little wallet and I have my light brown accents of jewelry. I have my gold jewelry, my brown earrings. And I did have on a brown bracelet, but I, it just felt like it was doing too much. So I'm not wearing that, but I'm about to head out. It's super cold outside, so I'm wearing my little bomber jacket, even though I don't like the way it looks with this outfit. But I'm wearing it and I'm going to go meet Joy. So I'll see you guys. Hey everybody. Hey everybody. Oh, excuse me, bro. <laughs> Hold on. I'm going to show them your hair. So I just finished Anaya's hair. I have her. It's a mohawk. It's four braids going up that way, but this one's going to fall into the hair after I untwisted in the morning. So it's going to be untwisted right here, untwisted in the back, and then you have the three braids going into the middle into a bun. And sis is cute. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Are we getting ready for bed? Yeah. All right, it's time to brush our teeth. That's not yours. Where's yours? Oh. Thanks. Oh. What color is your top? Uh, orange. Orange. Good job. Say everybody good night. Good night, everybody. See you later. See you later. Peace out. Peace Yo, it is your girl, Elf Catrice. And it's Saturday. I have not vlogged all week. I literally have not done anything but work, come home, sleep, work, come home, sleep, work, come home, sleep. Yeah, y'all saw I did nice hair. But, um, Today is Saturday, I just got off. I'm actually headed to 
one of my um, used to be kids at the daycare birthday party. His birthday was this week, uh, the day before. No, it's not, it wasn't the day before Valentine. I think it was the 12th. That was his birthday. Um, and so he, they're having a little party at the, um, I think it's like Get Air or the Bounce House or whatever. Um, and I is with her dad. So she's not going to be here this year. We went last year, if you remember that vlog. But I'm headed there again this year to go see my little friend, tell them happy birthday, hang out with them and the mom and everything. Uh, so that's what I'm doing today. Um, I have absolutely no plans. Happy Valentine's Day to those who had their significant others and happy Valentine's Day to us single folks. Uh, I did absolutely nothing yesterday. Yesterday just felt like a regular day for me. I went to work, I came home, Anaya wasn't there, so I ain't had nobody to play with. So I just watched a little YouTube, watched some TikTok, Watch me, uh, I watched Pitch Perfect, Pitch Perfect 1 and 2, had me a little sandwich, and I called it a night. I ain't really have, like, I wasn't trying to go to the movies or do nothing because I knew it was going to be busy. So I just stayed home and chilled, and I needed that sleep. Like, I think I went to sleep like 11. I really needed that sleep because the night has not been sleeping well, or she's been interrupting my sleep for the past, like, three or four days before. I think um, Thursday and Friday she actually slept very well because she was tired from the other two days that she kept me up. So she slept all the night, the other two nights. But uh, I have been missing out on sleep. Like I, I still feel that I'm tired and I, pro I probably need to go home and go to sleep now. But I don't want to miss his birthday. I always Take the third him exit on the right. Then keep him. left immediately so onto US 19 party. North toward Atlanta. And I'll uh, do that. And then the um, All Star contest three point shootout and the other whatever the other contest is that's today too so i'm gonna try to be home by eight o'clock or, or i might end up going to view the all-star game at the hot stadium or my you know well i ain't gonna go nowhere um so i, I want to be home to view that i i love watching those they're interesting to me and it's like it's cool to watch so is this where i'm supposed to be going the georgia connector i don't like using this car gps it don't be telling me like to take a certain exit it just say the name of the area I'm going to but um nonetheless that's where I'm headed um tomorrow I don't really have any take the second exit on the right okay. then keep left immediately okay keep left immediately uh, I don't have any plans tomorrow I'm gonna probably try to rest as much as I can I am going to church, of course. Oh, I need to do my hair. So I'll just slick it back. Um, Keep next left. Then take the next left. What in the world? But yeah, I'm going to try to get some more footage. I'm going to post my chit chat get ready with me tonight or possibly tomorrow. Um, that'll be the video for this week. And then I'll just compile the last two weeks worth of footage for next week's vlog um keep next not left. really having any footage because i haven't done anything but yeah that's pretty much it for now i'll probably pick up the camera once i get to the actual place i don't have my actual hand camera i'll just be vlogging on my phone um while i'm there so i'll see you guys in a little <laughs> Keep falling, girl. 